Welcome to East Lansing, Michigan, Spartan Stadium and home of the Michigan State Spartans. This matchup today, part of the lifeblood of the sport, a rivalry game where the results will be remembered for a lifetime. As we'll see the number one team in the country, the Michigan Wolverines, taking on a fellow Big Ten foe, the Michigan State Spartans. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Reese Davis, David Pollock, and Jesse Palmer with me. Guys, it's time to get it going. They'll leave it with him. Trucks through the defender. The Wolverines often look at this rivalry as their birthright to win, and boy, did they put the hammer down in a blowout last year. Yeah, and you heard a lot of hail to the victors, and you heard a lot about little brother and a lot of shots throughout this last year about how Mitch just keeps moving. Hit the gas, kid, wide open ahead. Touchdown, Michigan. He ran through tackles like water through a sieve. You know, oftentimes in college football, the best offenses are the ones that can create explosive plays just like you saw right there. They're top ten in the nation. And Wants to throw on first down off the play fake. Into the end zone. Almost intercepted. They took a shot on first down and just about turned the thing over. The incompletion brings us to second and ten. Jackson going to throw it. Moves around to clear up the vision. Nowhere close on that one as he got drilled trying to deliver the football and now they face third down. From the gun, wants to pass. And he couldn't find quite enough running room to reach the line to gain. They'll dial up the run on first and goal. And he's loose and he'll take it to the house. Touchdown Wolverine. Strike just as we expected. Yeah, and quick strikes are easy when you got such great field position. Obviously, when the offense starts in such a good spot, puts the defense. One running back in the backfield, and he has it. Gets him away from trouble. That's a pickup of six. Mark it at the ten. Listen to this crowd just shaking the girders of this place trying to help their defense. Brought to the ground, but not before getting enough for the first down. This offense will start doing business from their own 18-yard line on first down. Looking to the big tight end. Excellent coverage and good use of the hands to knock it away. They'll line up for a second down play. Zone coverage that time, and the cornerback, a nice job with his eyes. He's watching the quarterback. He sees the ball thrown, so he knows exactly when to break on it. He's able to break it up for an incompletion. Got room at the 35. Oh, look out. Quarterback gets the first down. The 20. They get him on the ground, but not before he rumbles all the way to the 5. Time winding down in the quarter as they come to the line. They'll try to get it in with the run. Touchdown, Michigan! And they take it in for six more points. They want to finish the season strong, and man, are they doing that here this Week 11 performance. He makes his way into the end zone for the 50th time in his career. Man, what a mark to hit. I
They'll try the right side. Thrust that arm out. Makes a pass to Marker. Finally run out of bounds, but he has this offense rolling with a first down. Those who stay will be champions, so said Bo Schembechler, and those who keep it on the ground churn out first downs. Yeah, it's, it's because it's a way of life, right? It's that physicality. It's going to be hard in practice all week when you're in Michigan. It's going to be grind. It's going to be physical. That's who they are. They won't compromise. And if you get to stick around here recently, a lot of success, too. They get him on the ground, but not before he gets enough for the first down. The Wolverines with the first and ten. And he has a solid game before the defense bottles him up. Really important for a ranked team going into a hostile environment like this one not to give the underdog reason to believe. Yes, reason to believe. All kinds of running room. He's piled up 87 yards rushing. He continues to impress as he leads the nation in rushing. They ripped off a huge chunk, and now a little chunk is needed to pay it off. A first down run in the red zone. He works his way all the way down to the three, and the defense is reeling. Second and goal for this offense. And down here near the goal line, you've got to be physical. And he takes it in for the score. Touchdown, Wolverines! Precision blocking up front created the open lane, and the running back followed it beautifully. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty easy to follow an offensive line that makes those holes and just gives you a caravan all the way... Taylor has it. They knock him down after a gain of three to the 23. Got three on first down at second and seven. Guys, these two have been showing contempt and disdain for each other for more than a century. First meeting back in 1898. Yeah, and my goodness, you think about all the years, all the plays. You think about Mike Hart a few years ago. What was he talking about? Little brother. That stung Michigan State so bad. The hatred for each other is what makes this game so fun to follow every single year. And I always feel in this game specifically between Michigan and Michigan State, it's the big-time players and the Heisman candidates that have always stepped up and made big plays. So I can't wait to see what the best players in this game are ready to do. They pick up half of it. It'll be second and five. As we reach the two-minute warning, they'll need to try to get a stop to keep this thing from getting out of hand. Jackson will throw. Fires to the big fella. Paul Bunyan, a huge part of trophies in the Big Ten. He's got an axe. He's got this trophy for the Spartans and the Wolverines. Where do you guys rank this trophy? Yeah, it's hard to say. I mean, there's so many trophy games, I feel like, in the Big Ten, David. I, this game, obviously, it always has Big Ten implications, national championship implications. I will be honest, Paul Bunyan trophy gives me the heebie-jeebies a bit. You don't like it, it just kind of kind of gives you the heebie-jeebies, I hear you. But how about Reese throwing a ranking on this? Rank the trophies? Reese, what are we doing here? We're not ranking trophies. Huge rivalry game, a lot of emotions. I'm talking about ranking trophies. Now down to the 12-yard line, it's first down. It's just so nice to have a QB under center nowadays in football. You can trust these guys. You put so much on their plate, and you tell them, they'll get positive yards when it's there. And a lot of these guys are such great athletes, they do it with the touchdown, Michigan. And they add six more to the board with that trip to the house. They score for the big fella here. Why are tight ends so effective in the red zone? Well, these aren't the guys that are going to burn by you and go for 70 most of the time. But when you can use their big body frames, threaten them to run the football. And... They keep it on the ground to open the third. Solid run. Picks up six and gets it to the 28. Six-yard pickup on first down. Leaves him with second and four. And that's another productive run. This offense has had a bunch of them today. And the running back, I think this lead was built on this guy. He's done a great job all game long setting the tone. And I think that's why this offense has been successful. Off the play fake on first down. The throw. He's going to take off. Really nice job by this sophomore quarterback to pick up the first down with the run. 
Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. It's going to be tough on this defense containing this guy because he's got that sixth sense to get outside the pocket, and at that point, he's thrown it and hurt you, or he can take off and run. That time, able to get the first down. Big challenge for the defense moving forward. Still running at the 40. They'll finally get him on the ground, but not before. He makes it to the 30 and gets a first down. This drive has been exclusively on the ground. Could they be setting up a shot play? They get him off his feet after a pickup of five down to the 25. Halfway there on first down, it's second and five. From the gun, give on the inside. And he's brought down, but the defender got a face full of stiff arm before he picked up that first down. And the Wolverines come to the line with a new set of downs. To the ground, he's got it again. They'll rip off eight on that play, it's second and two. Going to work in the red zone, they can't pick up the first down without getting it into the end zone. They'll go to the ground. Touchdown, Wolverines! And the beatdown has ensued. The Wolverines have a nice little cushion in that Paul Bunyan trophy almost within their grasp. Sparty can't quit, though. This game means too much in the rivalry, in the conference play, in... The give is to Taylor. Turns it on in midfield! And he was off to the races, finally tripped up at the 36. It's a first and 10. We know this guy is in contention right now for the Heisman Trophy. And this late in the year, if you're going to bring that home... Got a lot of running room. Touchdown, Michigan! And the route is on. You're not going to keep the lid on this guy forever. Sooner or later, he's going to get loose. He is. He's a bad mother. Shut your mouth. I mean, this dude can make plays. That's why you keep feeding it to him, because at some point... The give. Just working and poking and prodding and finding his way up to the 36. They can really be aggressive after that last play at second and three. They think they can create space here with the run to the right. At the 45 on its way. And there they go again. Another huge gain on the ground. As they get set to snap at time, winding down here in the quarter. Hand off from the shotgun. And they get him on the ground, and that'll probably do it for the third quarter. Yeah, and that's a great job by this offense. And I'll tell you what, fourth quarter, you have the lead. That's exactly what you want to do. Lean on these guys, run the football, eat that clock. I guess if you're an optimist, the stage is set for a massive fourth quarter comeback. After the nine-yard pickup on first down, here's second and one. Quick strike complete. Touchdown, Wolverine! And the pummeling has started. That score might be the one to put them over the top and run this winning streak to nine. Now they've got a little breathing room. They are in firm control of this game, guys, but you never want to... Keeping it on the ground on first and goal. Touchdown, Michigan! And the stomping has commenced. This team just knows how to finish. They keep getting better and better and better, and they are close to going 9-0. Man, this has been a complete... To the ground with the back. Keeps the legs moving. And he'll get it up to the 38. It'll be a first down. 
Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. And obviously, if you're going to be in the discussion for the Heisman Trophy, you got to be putting out big stat games week in, week out. He's been doing it all season long and obviously had over 100 rushing yards his last time out. He's doing it again here today in a game where a lot of Heisman Trophy voters, they're watching this one. They'll keep it on the ground, trying to milk the clock. Yeah, this coaching staff, they're getting this offensive line lathered up and into a rhythm. Now they're letting them drive off the ball on first down on these running plays, and they're getting chunks of yardage. One step wrap, two step squeeze. This junior knows how to get him on the ground. Here on third down, will they go back to the running game? To the ground to try to pick up the first. And he was loose and in the open field and on his way. A tremendous pickup on that one. They've moved it to the 19, first and 10. Quick pass on the fly motion. Got some room, headed to the goal line. And they're going to score again. Yet another touchdown as they just add to their total. And what can you say about this offense in this game? All season long, they've done enough to win week in, week out. Hasn't always been pretty. They haven't always brought their A-plus game to the park. Here's the handoff. Just willed his way for a couple out to the 35. That's a really good job by the defense, wrapping them up, getting them on the ground, take away that run game, make them one dimensional, put them in passing situations. Really good job by the defense. And now on second down for this offense. Got the first down and more. And he's brought down after a nice game. And it's runs like that, man, where he just shows you a little bit of everything that is the reason why he's in the Heisman race. Like, this dude leads the nation in rushing for a reason. They hand him the football a lot. They trust him, and he continues to deliver and make big play after big play. This dude is an absolute superstar. What a good run there. He has enough for the first down. The Wolverines come to the line with a fresh set of downs. Taylor has it. And he's a real nowhere man tackled in this no-game land. Got stumped on first down. It's second and ten. Out of the gun. They'll run it inside. On the move at the 30. And chunk plays are the name of the game. And they get one here before the defense finally makes the stop. Just inside the red zone. First and ten from the 19. And this is exactly where you want to be as an offensive coordinator. Like, when you've got the lead late in the football game, just run the football, eat the clock. Man, they put a good day together. They, they, they've, had a, they've had their way with this defense. A lot of positive things to point to. This is one of those weeks when you watch tape, it's going to be really fun to watch. Not like when you get beat up. A lot of big plays from this offense. Wide receiver's going to get a shot at it on first and goal. Relentless, tough running gets it down to the four. The big fellas line up in a goal line defense. He's going to the right looking for a path to the end zone. Touchdown Wolverine. And the punishment has been extended. The lead grows and you can sense they know how important wins are this late here in week 11. And how about this squad, man? Looking good again. Like, I feel like we say this... No matter how much college football changes, realignment, all of that kind of stuff, rivalries are consistent, and winning rivalry games, well, that's just the best. Because they hate each other so much, so you take the field against your rival, and you're able to put forth a performance like that. That is worth its weight in gold, David. Unbelievable effort here by the winning team at Bragg and Wrights now bragging rights for a while it's it's a fun thing to be able to accomplish now we also got to take in the next couple games because this is always there's a letdown that naturally happens after these big rivalry wins we feel like our chest is poked out we got to look on to the next game focus in on this next one so that's going to do it for us for jesse palmer david pollock i'm reese davis saying so long this has been another presentation of ea sports college football